Back, what purpose does the gentleman from Oklahoma seek recognition? Speaker asks for unanimous consent to revise and extend my remarks. The gentleman is recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, I stand before you today not only as a member of Congress but as a concerned American. As a country, we cannot continue to ignore Obamacare's impact on jobs and small businesses. This past Friday, our nation witnessed yet another rise in, un in the unemployment rate. Why is it becoming increasingly difficult for nearly 12 million Americans to secure a job? When you attack a small business, you attack the backbone of our economy. American employers are struggling to manage this job-killing health care law. Health care now tops the concerns facing small business owners like myself. We will have to make the tough choice to whether we comply with the health care mandate or reject it. This is yet another regulation that is choking our economy at a time when we should be creating more jobs. Obamacare also empowers the scandal-plagued IRS, an agency that in 2010 alone administrated $17 billion in improper payments to the Earned Income Tax Credit. Where is the recovery America was promised? It is time we put America back in business. Mr. Speaker, I yield back. Someone yields back.